them there they take me something at the damn TSA eh it was a new one and the lady she looked upon my bag and she see it and that face she give me Welcome back to my channel. What's poppin'? 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 What's Welcome back to my channel. It is your girl Essence of Shay Tiger Lily Squad. Stand up, gang, 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 gang. In this video, we will be talking about we will be talking about my top five shampoos that I have used in the past and present that I feel are best for your lock hair journey. No? Okay. Before we get into the video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Don't also forget to turn on your notification bells. Apparently, YouTube is cock, cock blocking your girl. Disrespect. Number one is a homemade black soap shampoo. There are loads of videos out there teaching you how to make this black shampoo, black soap shampoo. It's actually really good for your hair because black um, soap has like vitamin E and it has like shea butter in there as well, but the shea butter is not bad for the locks in that way. It's really odd. But you know what you're putting in there because you can put all type of essential oils in that shampoo. So all in all, sis, Homemade shampoo is the way to go, duh. Number two is the Shea Moisture Black Caster. I think I'm saying it right, I'll put a picture. Black Caster Shampoo. This shampoo is actually really good at like keeping the moisture in your hair while still stripping it of all like the dirt and the gunk and stuff. And this shampoo, surprisingly does not flake up in my locks when I wash it out is easy to rinse out I never have any troubles with it I actually really like their shampoo so good job Shea Moisture I tried this uh, a couple years ago it's the Dr. Locks Yasmin shampoo it's super lightweight super gets to the point it washes my hair effortlessly and I have no issues with it and it smells good too. TGIN that's a company TGIN I'll put like a picture up as well. This shampoo is a little on the thicker side it's almost like a conditioner but not a conditioner and it does the trick of putting a conditioner in your hair that you know we can't do because it keeps your hair so moisturized. I haven't used it in a while but I kind of want to go back and test it out again to make sure my theory is completely correct. If you guys want to see a video of me reviewing any of these shampoos let me know in the description box below. Last but not least you guys know my absolute favorite shampoo because I talk about it every day all day every day all day every day all day honey is the Dr. Bronner's peppermint shampoo this has tea tree oil it feels like there's eucalyptus in there but I know there's not because they have a eucalyptus one it strips the hair completely sis strips it completely Sometimes, I mean, I have to mix it with like some oils just so the moisture is not taking out my hair completely. But this shampoo is the GOAT. Do you hear me? The GOAT. And for an extra bonus, I have an extra one for you guys. It's the Neutrogena shampoo. Listen, I bought one to review it here. I haven't actually used that one yet, but I bought one to review it. And them there, they take me something at the damn TSA. Eh? It was a new one, and the lady, she looked upon my bag and she see it. And that face she give me, it just showed me eh, that she wanted that shampoo. So she took it, talking about it was too big. Girl, that shampoo's small as heck. Look at a picture of it right here. That shampoo's small, sis. I know what you did. 
I know what you did. Anyways, guys, these are my top five shampoos that I need for you to try with the added bonus one. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to your girl and also leave in the comment box below what shampoos have you tried that are really good for your lock hair journey leave it in the comment box below because I want to try something else you know you gotta just switch it up a little bit all right tiger lilies see you later crash course let me have the money in the dashboard max mad could you lost the brick inside the porch goofy with the curb